At class, today we're going to be working with clay. You also have a canvas board to work on. There is some wooden tools for molding and rolling and even a sponge for smoothing out the clay. So let's start playing with the clay and exploring. Let's try squeezing the clay to start. What do you notice about the clay? Do you see anything getting on your hands when you squeeze the clay? How about rolling the clay? Let's try rolling the clay. Can anyone make a ball with the clay? Rolling, 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 rolling. Let's see what other shapes or forms we can create. Here's my ball. If I hold my hands with a V and go back and forth, I can turn my ball into a cone. Make a cone with me. Mmm, ice cream cone. I'm going to add a few decorations to make it look like an ice cream cone. <laughs> How fun! Let's make another shape. Roll it back into a ball. This time, let's try squeezing the sides. Squeeze, or maybe it's more of a pinch. And I'm rotating it. I'm trying to make a cube. This shape's a little harder to make. It's not being squared, it's turning more into a rectangular prism. I can also tap to make a nice smooth side. I'm gonna keep trying that. Go ahead class, start tapping your clay and see if you can make smooth sides. Oh, ooh, I'm starting to see my cubes looking nice. Let's count how many sides. There's one side. Two sides, three, four, five, six. There's six sides. I made a dice. Yay! This time, let's try to make a coil instead of a ball. So I'm going to take my clay and go back and forth. Oh no, it's getting kind of lumpy here. Squeeze that and keep going. Here we go. I'm going to place mine on my board and start rolling it to make my coil. Go ahead and try, try to roll your clay to make a coil. Mine started to get flat, so I'm going to squeeze it and then I'm going to keep rolling it. Rolling, rolling, rolling. Ooh, mine keeps getting flattened. It's not really round. Let me squeeze this so it does be round. And then let's roll some more. Rolling. Let's see if I can do it with both hands. Ooh. Let me squeeze it. Making coils are a little hard. Can you guess what I'm going to make with my coil? Oh, my coil is as long as the board now. How long can you make your coil? Oh, it's longer than the board. And look right here and here where it's on the board's edge. Oh, it leaves marks behind. I could use that on purpose for my art if I wanted to. Let's see here. I'm turning my coil into a spiral. And it's a snake. Psst. Can you make a snake? Or maybe you want to make it into a snail. 
I'm going to take a few pieces off and make a little coils for <gasps> yay I made Gary from Spongebob Meow. let's see oh let's use my rolling pen has anyone used their rolling pen yet I'm going to oh, smooth out my clay with my rolling pen. And then I'm going to flip it over and smooth it out. Fun! I can use my tool to write in my clay. Oh, and I can use my sponge to smooth out my clay too. Fun. Hi. <laughs> what else can I do? Oh, can I draw a line? Oh, ooh, I can use this tool to cut my clay. Go ahead and try to cut your clay class. See what you can use this tool for. Ooh, I'm making a wall. I'm building my clay. This is called slab building. Look, I'm making, I'm making a little, little shelf. How fun! Let's see, what else can we make with our clay? I'm gonna roll it up, roll it into a ball. And pound it into a ball like this too, if you'd like. That can be fun. And push my finger into it and pinch. And go in a circle. This is how you make a cup. Look, I'm making a cup with my clay. This is called a pinch pot. Look at those cracks. I can use my sponge and smooth out the cracks. Ooh, let's save some. I'm gonna take some clay and I'm gonna make a coil. Ooh, how fun. I made a cup. I need to smooth this out some more. Use my finger to smooth all this out. Join the clay together. Look at those cracks in there. The sponge is a nice tool, but I think my finger is my favorite tool. <gasps> Look, I made a cup. Well, I can't wait to see what you are going to make. Till next time. Keep being creative.